the Sam Quayley and you're watching season one, episode three of the Sam Quayley Star Wars show on YouTube. And please welcome my dad, Keith Quayley. Hi. Hi. How does it feel to be on the show? Uh, it's very exciting. This is my very first time ever on YouTube. This is my, the subject is favorite droid, droids. And here to talk, my dad's going to talk about it with us on this today's episode. So who's your favorite droid, Dad? Well, you know, I like the obvious ones that you see in the movies, the C-3PO's and R2-D2. Uh, but I want to give a little special nod to L9, who was in the Solo movie, who's kind of a self-aware droid like L9 knows that L9 is a droid and is kind of even like fighting for the rights of droids and seems to have like real human feelings and unfortunately L9 dies in the movie and it's really one of the saddest <laughs> saddest scene in that movie I think yeah me too and I my favorite droids are C Flippy and R D D two the main robots and I also like BB eight and we can't good point we can't forget about BB eight and what about that droid in Rogue One that I don't remember the name of? Um, that we pulled in droid? And... I can't remember either, but he's an Imperial droid who's been reprogrammed uh, by the good guys. And he fights on the side of good. And uh, I don't want to do any spoilers for the movie, but um, he doesn't survive either. And for some reason, robot deaths are very sad to me. And Dad, didn't you want to have a special shout out to some... Some people that didn't watch Star Wars yet? Well, I just wanted to say um, a special thanks to R4. If R4 had not been good enough to blow up in A New Hope, uh, then Luke's uncle never would have taken R2-D2. And, and then they would never find that match. Yeah, Leia and all Westfield history would have been changed. I mean, who knows if R2-D2 would have ever found Obi-Wan Kenobi. Because who knows what would have happened to him. So, big, big moment. Droids yeah, that played, is a big moment. Droids have played a huge role in the Star Wars movies. They have saved the lives of people. What about all of They've four? opened doors. Uh, R2-D2 is very good at opening doors. For what about reason. all of four that was with, that was with Obi-Wan Kenobi in the Attack of the Clones in the Revenge of the Sith? Yeah, even uh, Jedi seem to like it and have a uh, droid sidekick. RDD2 was with Anakin. Can droids become Jedi's, don't you think? It would be cool to see a droid as a Jedi instead of a human or something. Um, I think the Force only revolves around living things, so I don't think droids can really be part of the Force. I don't know. That's a good or question. Or a Jedi? Right, I don't think they can be a Jedi. But there might be something that maybe Jedi's can feel in the Force. That's a good question. I don't know. If c 3 was created by Anakin Skywalker, which later had the Force after he built him. C-3PO has definitely evolved through all the films from having like no skin to being black and then gold and then red arms and legs and <laughs> so I wonder what's with the red arm in the Force Awakens like yeah, I don't know if they ever really explained where the red arm came from. Or there was a, there was kind of a dark BB-8 on Kylo Ren and Snoke's ship in the Last Jedi. Kind of a dark BB-8 kind of character. Um, there's been a lot of interesting, cool, and scary-looking droids. It's a dark. Through all the movies, it's black so it's and it kind of looks movies. like BB-8 and stuff. In fact, Star Wars may be one of the, the first movie or one of the only movies ever where robots or droids have been major characters throughout the series. We have robots here that kind of, that we made, that one of them we made together and one of them me and my mommy made that were called Robot Jilly and Robot Lisa. They could be part of the Rebellion and part of the Force too. And Yeah, maybe. All right. And now, that's it for today. Catch us tomorrow well, again. Catch, always catch me tomorrow. Thank you for joining us, Dad. You're welcome. Okay, see you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye.